Hello everyone, this is Talanos, and you are watching The Chronicles of Odd Park, Day 15. This is the daily blog of our town in the game Die Tonight. And uh, once again, you can find that game at dietonight.com. There's a link in the description. Now, on to the Gazette. Looking at our Gazette for the day, you can see that we had 1,482 zombies try to get through our 2248 defense. So none of them got in, no deaths from that. We had winds in the northeast, which is, you know, in the heart of zombie territory. And you can see, yet again, we have another victim. This time, Hubert Cumperdale. You can see his soul page here. Hubert uh, died from, you know, not being online when the attacks happened. No uh, suicide postings. So we believe this one to just be a simple forgot to log in or had connection problems before the attack. You can see he's now in a town called the Retarded Pits, which is a pretty cool name for a town, I guess. Uh, anyway, his last words were very simply, bye. So you will be missed, Hubert Cumperdale. Uh, good luck in the Retarded Pits. Although we lost another member of our town, we were pleasantly surprised to see that we made it to number one in the unofficial rankings of the surviving towns of the world. So uh, as I said, unofficial ranking, it's a algorithm that scores uh, all the items in your bank and all the people you have and the water in the well. It places a lot of emphasis on the water in the well. So since we finished that mega pump, that shot us up here as we drain that uh, uh, well some more, I anticipate we'll probably drop a little bit here in the standings. But uh, it's fun to be at the top of the list, even though it doesn't really mean anything. We had replenishment in the southeast, and since we had a lot of scavs there already, and it's a very small area, I went to the northwest to explore a uh, couple zones that were still undepleted and a couple buildings that still had... Uh, some items left in them too. So I went out and uh, this is what I brought back in a little segment we like to call Today's Hall. I brought back a machete, which I also use to help clear some of the zombies. I brought back a pharma product, uh, some scrap metal, a trestle, which is that heavy defensive item, and uh, two rations of food here, which came from one giant rat, I believe, that I found at our shady bar. Construction was quite busy for us on day 15. Uh, as you know, we finished two of our mega projects yesterday. So today we went and cleared out a bunch of the smaller projects that we still had left. We made the cremado queue to barbecue uh, our friend that uh, died of dehydration. We built armor plating, uh, which gives you some defense there. Uh, the plate gun, which I recommend you build later in the game. It takes uh, five nuts and bolts, which is quite a bit, three Semtex, and uh, three sheet metals, which are defensive items. You still get a net gain in defense, but that's why I recommend you build it later in the game as it uh, uses quite a bit of valuable resources there. We also unlock the emergency supplies, which gives you temporary defenses that you can build, which only last one night. Uh, very helpful in dealing with uh, large zombie spikes when you need to construct a lot of additional defenses uh, very quickly. We also once again voted for the upgradable wall for our upgrades. And uh, here is a look at our predictor where you can see the attacks that we're looking at uh, in the future. Pretty close to the same number. Uh, we're still over 2,000 defense, so you know none of those are really going to cause us any trouble there. Some people were asking to see our citizens page, so here's a good uh, look at it here. You can see that we try to put uh, the job that we're doing in the uh, personal message column there so if you're a constructor a scavenger uh, what your health status is and then we even put our drinking days so that we uh, know when people are drinking and when they're not uh, you can see most of us are at the hovel level we're starting to slowly build up our houses because we're running out of uh, buildings to to work on so we're uh, up slowly upgrading our houses there that's all i have for today uh, please subscribe so you can see how long we can last. Uh, we've had a streak here of uh, death every day, so hopefully we can kick that habit here pretty soon. Uh, as always, please leave your comments, questions, and tips below, and I'll try to address them in the videos. Uh, and I will see you guys on day 16.